In this video, I'll show you how to use AirPrint with your broader laser printer, any models that are looking like this one, and an iPad, iPhone, or even a Mac computer. AirPrint, what it is basically is that you connect your broader printer to your Wi-Fi network, the same that your Apple device is currently connected to. And this way you don't have to install any software, any apps, anything, it will work right away. And I'll show you how to send any print from your device to the broader printer once you have connected it to the internet. So the first step is to actually go over here on the control panel of your broader laser printer and connect it to your Wi-Fi network. We're going to press the up arrow to navigate through the menu. Press it a few times until you see network. Then confirm by pressing OK. Once you see WLAN Wi-Fi, press OK once again. It will say Find Network, press OK, and it will start searching for all the Wi-Fi networks that are currently around the printer. Now use the up and down arrow to navigate through the names of all the networks that uh, the printer has detected. So this is my Wi-Fi network, I'll press OK and we'll have to enter the password. Now, unfortunately, there is no keyboard, so it'll be a bit hard to do it, but by using the up and down arrow, you're gonna go through all the numbers and then all the letters, okay? And once you have selected, let's, let's say your password starts with an H, well, you're gonna press the OK, it will register, and then you'll go to the next one, and same thing, if you have characters, press the down arrow and you'll go through them first before going through the numbers and letters. If you have capital letters, they'll appear right over here as well. This can take a few minutes, so let me just do it and come back when I'll, be, <laughs> I'll have written my whole password. Oh yeah, and by the way, if you want to delete, simply press the back button and it will delete whatever you uh, wrote there and you'll be able to input the right character. Once you are done entering the password, you're gonna press once more on the OK button. It will say apply settings, press the down arrow here to confirm. And now the printer is connecting to your Wi-Fi network. You're gonna get the confirmation connected once this is done. Now let me show you on an iPad. This works the same way on your iPhone, how to do it. And I will also show you how to do it on a Mac computer right after. All right, so on your iPad, what you need to do now is to open any files you wanna print. So I open my PDF file over here that is currently on my iPad. And what we need to do next is to find this icon. You see it's a square with an arrow pointing up. If you're trying to print a picture, go into the photo library, tap on your picture, and you're gonna see the same icon, but this time on the lower side of your iPhone or iPad, click on it. And then you're gonna have a few options down below, including print. If you're on an iPhone, you may need to scroll down to have access to the print uh, feature. So click on print. Under printer, make sure your broader printer is the one selected because it will search for all the printers that are currently on your Wi-Fi network. And since we have connected it, you should see it. Here we go, broader HLL2405W. This is my current printer. I'll click on it. Then select the number of copies you want, your paper size, you have other settings as well, and press print once you're ready. Usually it takes around 13 seconds to send the print to the printer. Here you go. We got our print. Now let me show you on your Mac computer. We need to go on the top left corner on your Mac, click on the Apple logo, then select system settings. From here, you're gonna go on the left side menu down until you select printers and scanners. Select it and you're gonna see all the printers and scanners that are currently connected on your Mac. But if you go all the way down, you should see add printer, scanner or fax. Click there and here press allow Select your broader printer, so this is mine, broader HLL2405W, and then press the add button right on the lower right side. 
The printer has now been added to your Mac. Everything is connected. So let me show you how to print any document. Now open any pictures or any PDF documents you wish to print. Go on the top left corner. You see where you uh, all the options are. Press on file. Go down and select print. From on uh, the top of this small menu, select your broader printer. And then make sure these settings are matching the project you're trying to print. Now, one of the important things you can check is under media and quality. Click here and where it says quality by default, it's normal, but you can select best if you want to get obviously the best image quality. I mean, the be best print quality. You can also select draft, but never do that. It will give you terrible results. So I'll select best and then press print. It takes only a few seconds. Make sure this is extended. The print will come out right over here. And here we go, we got our print. So this is about it. This is how you print using your Mac computer and your broader printer. If you want to support my channel, check my Amazon affiliate links down below, subscribe, like, and I'll see you in the next video.